Hey everyone, welcome back to Outward. And today what I'm doing is checking out a different entrance to the Conflux Mountain. Now this entrance is on the southwest side of the mountain and it's at the just at the very base. And I went in through the top and that's how I got into the uh lay vein but I want to check out this entrance too because I did come in here and there were a lot of enemies and it just simply didn't work out at that time but I, I've got some better equipment and, and some different tricks up my sleeve so I want to see if I'm able to like get through this one or, or not So I've uh, I haven't been posting kind of like uh, as I go here. I mostly have been just exploring around and getting to know the world. I'll probably keep that up and try to save you know posting something unless I, I've got an activity like I'm doing today. Like I've got a plan for what I'd like to do. Because just watching me kind of like walk in circles or, you know, walk straight forward for 40 minutes or so, not a very entertaining episode as such, but what is this? I already know. So I'll take these. I'll take the blessed potion. I'll even take the sandals. Because I break that stuff up. Is that an enemy? I don't know what that is. Just a rock. Okay. Doesn't seem to be anything else here, so... I'm gonna shut this lantern off. Low. Yeah, there's some enemies there. I saw them that they end up turning into stones and they can kind of hide on us, so. Yeah. Come in slowly and lay down some traps. See if this helps at all. Yeah, it doesn't look like it. He's coming. Getting them. They're not coming any further though. I'm not really gonna get into my traps. I might kill them. Just in case there's more where that came from. Lay down a little trail. Six pounds? Anyway. So I'm gonna uh, leave my bag here at the door and just take a sneak around that room. I don't need the extra weight.
I mean, this would be better with a lantern, but I, I can do that again, too. Oh, two of them. down. Okay, so I might be able to uh, hold off here. Let's have some food if we can get some. No, I, I actually want to use it. Oh, what's going on here? onto that target. Fuck it, I'll have to free aim. Really stupid. This happens a lot in this game. I'm getting a lot of, like, graphical glitches. This one might work in my favor. Just cheesing them at the doorway here. I don't know, it wouldn't lock on. I... Let's pick up our backpack and do this right. Might be because I'm too heavy. And yeah, it looks like I picked up a bunch of stuff here that didn't. Doesn't sort into your backpack if you're not wearing your backpack, it goes into your pocket. So there is a tunnel back here. Well, it looks like there's a creature there, so we're going to pull out and we'll take a closer look at this cavern here and see if there's like another exit. Looks like there's another exit on that side. And this is where I came in, so... this. I'm missing something here? What is this? I don't know what that is. Shit, shit, shit. Damn it. Bleed, bleed, bleed. One down. There we go. Two down. We 
Okay. We came from back there. What's this? Doesn't open from here, so there's a doorway around the other side. I think I'm gonna check this out. Sure is dark in here. Chest. Uh, so we have a dagger. I'll take the life potions. Fire rag, always popular. And a cooking recipe that I don't have. And some iron spikes, so I'll take that. Let's take a look at this cooking recipe. Okay, I'm not familiar with that recipe, so... Um, I'm just one more possible recipe that we can cook up. I have quite a few recipes at this point. around down here. That looks like it goes to the lay vein. And let's turn this off and see how bad it is. Might not be able to see anything. No, I can see okay. Let's look. Don't have any traps. Can I make some traps now? Or? No. What am I missing for traps? Just some iron. Might break that apart for some iron. I'm not sure. Uh, three mana stones. No iron, though. Well, that's too bad. Couple traps would really go a long way. Let's see how bad we can get him with one shot. Pretty good. Just keep hammering them with arrows here, we might get them. Yeah, we got them before you even... that? Oh, I was walking right on top of him. Oh, come on. Damn it. I might not survive this one. Okay, temporarily increases lightning damage and resistance. No, I don't really need that. Yeah. 
And I have to be on the lookout because it's quite dangerous to have. Just things that are hidden there suddenly pop up right behind me. So we got another chest that they were guarding. Uh, brutal spear is pretty good spear. Uh, warm potion. I'll take. Flint and stone I don't need and I don't need this. So I might just take this just to tear it apart. Yeah, I'll take that. And we'll take this too. And so I'm getting quite a bit of money here. I can sell these mana stones for quite a bit. I think they're like six bucks each. But I've, pick, I've been picking up quite a few of them, so uh, that certainly does help. I mean, you could just mine this place all day, every day. So that looks like a dead end from there. I'm gonna go back upstairs here. How bad am I? 90 hit points, okay. Well, that's not great, but it's not terrible, so let's keep going. I think that I could probably make some traps now if I want to keep exploring. Right, so this doorway that doesn't go anywhere. Um, what did we say it was over here? Let's take this and see what it breaks down to. Oh, I can't break that one down. Uh, the spear really has no value to me whatsoever if I can't break it down, so I'm just going to drop it. Make me feel a little safer if I had some traps. Just in the in the works here. Good. Five traps. It's not nothing. I'll just kind of. If I can squeeze them in this tunnel. If I can't. anybody in here but I'm just gonna lay another trap. I think I would have seen them by now. Over here. Explorer lantern's gonna burn out. Fuck is that one of these creatures? Okay, so we have a switch. We have a switch here. I don't know what the switch does. So refilling my explorer's lantern there. So, uh, I'm not sure really what this does or where it does it. done something I've, I'm not aware of it so I'm gonna pick these up because there's nobody down here I wasn't looking for anything that would have required a switch so I don't know if it's down in this oh, maybe it's, maybe it's this gateway but I don't see the gateway opening up so Maybe there's a second switch on this end. Let's, 
what's over here? Okay, so I think there was a creature down this way. So let's just prepare a little. gonna drop my backpack off. Ooh, that was a real good strike. And I'm out of ammo. <laughs> should have thought should have thought of that. There he goes. Throwing poison at me. The trap take care of him. One down. Uh, poison varnish, cool, and some uh, common mushroom and some thick oil on my lantern. I'll take it. Now you see me switching to my bow there, that's because I have a skill to increase the lock-on radius for my bow so I can lock onto a target, and it's a good way to check and see if there's an enemy in the room. I mean, it's not 100% effective, but... Oops. Looks like a person. I'm not 100% sure it's a person. Switch. Not sure what these switches are doing just yet. Yeah, that is a person. Armored. They are getting a little little stronger, but nothing uh, crazy. Mushroom halberd. I might just break that apart now. Oh, I can't. Okay, well, I'm going to drop it then because it doesn't have any value to me. some food real quick.
I'm now carrying three water jugs, uh, just because I think they're necessary to have. What the hell is this? I don't know. Just a bell? Couldn't tell you. I have no idea what that is, what it's for. Uh, let's go back and see if that door opened up. I guess we'll pick these up on our way by. so many somebody make a growling noise or something like that so there's one more tunnel right there but I'm going to check on these doors because I'm flipping these switches I'm not sure really what that's doing if anything so. is it changing this any in any way really couldn't say. Anyway, there's one more one more tunnel. an escape route if I need it. It's like, uh, you, you don't permanently die or anything when you, it's not like permadeath, but it can be very inconvenient to get knocked out in this game. You never know what you're, where you're going to be when you wake up, or what circumstances you're going to have. And originally I thought that there was a glitch where my backpack wasn't coming with me, but it seems to be that's the design of it. And, like, sometimes you can leave your backpack behind and you gotta, go, you gotta go back and get it. It's not exactly, uh, ideal, considering, um, there's not a lot of changes that I've made to the character from, from the start of this game. But, uh, it's, it's my equipment that's really made me more powerful and my ability to adapt when, when the time is needed. So I'm gonna just drop my backpack here. I'm gonna sneak out and see if I don't see anybody else. Yeah, there he is. Wow, that's a good hit. One down. I guess there's another one. Linen, don't mind if I do. Uh, mushroom, halibut, I like I said before, I can't really uh, can't really use that because I can't break it down. I'm gonna make some bandages. And I just wanna make sure, yeah. I just wanna make sure that they go in my pocket and not my backpack. And I could really use some traps right now. It doesn't look like I've got any. 
Oh shit, is this some corpses? That's crazy. So it looks like... We've got another switch. I'll take all that. Got a mushroom there. Take the star mushroom too. I think that's it. Okay, so uh, from my recollection, I pulled three switches there, uh, which seems like an odd number considering there were four paths. It has done nothing to this that I'm able to see. That I'm able to notice anyway. But the gateway's open. Okay, so the gate is open here. Let me just take a look. How bad am I here? 90-69 stamina. I think probably I could use a rest. I could probably set up camp here. And uh, come back in later. And finish going through this door. So I'm, I'm going to try that. Just see how bad it would be for ambushes if I did that. Hundred percent. Okay, but it's uh, let's get three hours of sleep, fifty-fifty on the ambushes, twenty percent on the ambushes. And we'll do one for repair. And then I'll have to have some water. So even if I get three hours of sleep, I think that I, I could, you know, probably go up a little bit in stamina at least and hit points. And that might give me a little bit more for going through. I have no idea what's on the other side of that. Area. So I'm out of traps. So we'll probably have to do some crafting too. Anyway, I'm going to cut it off here, and we'll pick it up at this spot next time. I hope you enjoyed. Thanks for watching.